What's up everybody? Well, I got another video for you guys today. And today I figured, much like my laptop dusting video, I figured I would do a quick dusting video on my secondary main computer too. So now today we're gonna clean up the secondary computer. Now, usually I clean this, dust this thing once a week, but I purposely didn't for about a month and some change just to let it get a little dust build up on it just to show you guys what to do. So this time I'm probably gonna take some of the fans out too, just so I can clean them a little easier. Can't really clean like the backs of the one in the back there and the ones on the side on the tops without taking them completely out. I can get to all the rest of the fans back blade areas where they get all nasty from inside the computer. Same thing with the GPU. Now a lot of times I take the GPU out but ever since I started having some computer problems back and forth with my main computer I stopped taking the GPU out because I just don't want to fuck with it. If it's not broken leave it the fuck alone. The more you take it apart and put it back in the more likely there you're going to have to break something. So if you don't have to take it out don't. Like I know there's this one guy on YouTube named Greg, Greg Salazar and he does like super deep cleaning videos where he takes it completely apart every little piece. We're not doing that on this one. This is just a basic video on dust cleaning and whatnot. So I'm sure this is probably gonna bore the shit out of a lot of people, but I figured, fuck it. Some people might find this interesting. So why not give it a shot? It's not like I'm gonna be doing dusting videos every freaking day. I just figured, why not? Did it on the laptop, let's do it on the other computers too. So let's not waste any more time or camera battery and let's hop on in and let's look at how dusty it is. Get the camera a little closer. Here we are, a little closer closer to everything so I'm sure you guys can see like on the GPU fan it's quite dusty in there and same thing with the back fans and all that all the fans are pretty pretty nasty right now to say the least so what we're gonna do is get in there and just clean everything up so let's not waste any more time and let's get to cleaning well, all right guys I did a quick light dusting just to get some of the dust out of there even though it's gonna get more dusty because look at what I found if you don't take your fans out obviously they get bad but this got way worse than I thought just from over a couple like a month. It never got that bad before. Make this easier on myself. I only hold these fans in with two screws in the top just so it's really easy to take out so I can do this. But damn, I didn't think it was gonna get that bad just from a month. So yeah, definitely don't wait months between your shit like I did just to show you an example. Because look at how bad that is. So I'm gonna take all the tops out and we're gonna clean these out. Obviously I would do that on camera, but I don't want to blow a bunch of freaking dust right all over this nice expensive camera. So I'm just gonna take my little duster I've got right here and also one of Danielle's old makeup brushes she gave me a while back. Once it was outlived its usefulness, she always gave me stuff like that because she knew it was good for dusting computers and stuff. So let's get these fans cleaned up now, shall we? All right, we ran just the duster over it so far and look at how much better that looks already. Now we'll take this guy and get rid of the remainder of the surface dust and then if there's anything left that just won't come off, we'll get a little bit of alcohol and a Q-tip to get the rest of it off. And then we can get that last fan out off camera and do that and then we'll be done with the whole top row, which will be pretty sick. Then we can get to doing the rest of the fans and we'll finish up with the GPU. All right guys, well we have dusted all of the fans with the little little mini duster makeup brush thing and now it is time to blow the radiator a little bit. Now let me just take you off of the tripod real quick just so I can show you what I mean. See it looks pretty uh pretty gross so we'll deal with that and then I still have to deal with the other sides of those two back fans too and then we've got to mess with the GPU too and clean him up so let's carefully put that back into the tripod where it'll be safe and now why don't we go ahead and blow out that radiator well guys here we go we've got the radiator all blown out it doesn't look flawless obviously like brand new but much better than it did before and then I dusted off this whole door a little bit not perfect so got a couple spots like right there but now I have got to do these fans look at how bad those are if it'll focus not very good at all but once we do that we can do another quick dusting and then run it over with a little anti-static towel thing and then we can be all good. So I'm going to turn the camera back off and get to dusting a little bit more and then we'll do the final dusting and then turn the camera back on to show you how it all looks. I'll probably dust the monitor and keyboard out as well. Well all right guys we are pretty much done dusting. I went and did a dusting over all the little parts with a microfiber cloth so it should look a lot better. Now the video card fan that thing just no matter how many q-tips and how, how much alcohol I used I cannot get those small little spots clean it's like the q-tip just can't reach in there even if I let it get like half dilapidated no matter what it looks clean for a second but then the second it dries it looks kind of like that so that's my own bad for letting it get that bad just for an example of how to clean your computer shouldn't have done that oh well I'll just have to really 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 sit there for like hours and clean that up and then not ever let it get that bad again or I could just not care because no one's really gonna notice anyway but I figured let me take 
take you guys off of the tripod just to show you, just to show you guys. Everything in there looks a lot cleaner now. May not be perfect, but it's a lot better. Oh, and then check that out. Completely level on the GPU. Now we can look at the top. And the front. And all right. And with that, we can put you guys back on the safety of the tripod so I don't drop my expensive badass camera here. And now, why don't we go ahead and put the glass back on and do a first post and make sure I didn't fuck anything up while I was cleaning. But I'm usually pretty careful, but just cause you're usually careful doesn't mean stuff can't get fucked up. So let's go put the glass side panel on and do that Buddha. All right guys, we got everything put back together. We got the side panel on there, all dusted and everything. Now the mouse pad still looks pretty bad, but I'd have to take everything off of the freaking thing to really dust that off perfectly. So I think after I'm done with the video, I'll just run my little microfiber cloth all over it. That'll get most of it off. But I think that mat really just needs a nice washing. It hasn't been cleaned since I got it. <laughs> but anyway, before we turn on our computer here, let's take a quick hit of either victory or I'll be calm if it breaks. All right. And now, for the moment of truth. Oh, ha, I would have, uh, I would have had quite the issue here. We forgot to plug the freaking video card back in. There we go. Now it should show us a picture. Keyword is should. There we go. We'll grab our mouse. Oh, there it goes. Here we are. And look at that. Turned right on. Looks a shit ton cleaner now. I'm sure the computer appreciates it. And now I need to let everything charge. Like my camera's almost dead. My dust, my battery powered handheld duster is dead. I've got that plug in one and it's good for certain things, but it's not good for getting into the fans like the other one was. But gotta let everything charge and then we'll move into the main computer room and do the main computer as well. That one I have not sat there and not cleaned. That one I've been keeping up on. So that one won't be as bad, but we'll still give it a small little cleaning that'll probably be a very short ass video but still want to do it anyway but anyway i hope you guys enjoyed this video still because i sure as hell enjoyed making it for you and until the next video peace out guys